India successfully test-fired its nuclear-capable surface-to-surface ballistic missile Agni-5, the most advanced missile in the Agni series with a strike range of over 5,000 kms from a test range off Odisha coast on January 18, 2018. All radars, tracking systems and range stations monitored the flight performance, defense sources said. Describing the trial as fully successful, the sources said, the sophisticated missile traveled for 19 minutes and covered 4,900 kilometers. Here we look at top 5 facts about Agni-5. Number 5. Introduction Agni-5 is an intercontinental ballistic missile developed by the Defense Research and Development Organization, DRDO, of India. Agni-V is part of the Agni series of missiles, one of the missile systems under the original Integrated Guided Missile Development Program. It is reported to have a range of 5500 to 5800 kms by the DRDO but international defense experts mainly from China claim the range of the missile is understated and its actual range is 8000 kms. While the first test was conducted on April 19, 2012, the second and third tests were carried out in 2013 and 2015. The last test was done on December 26. 2017. Number 4. Specifications. Each Agni-5 missile is 17.5 m in length and 2 m in diameter and weighs 50 tons while carrying a warhead of 1,500 kgs. It is powered by a three-stage solid fuel engine and reach up to a speed of 24 Mach in terminal phase. Its range is 5,000 kms as stated by DRDO but according to international defense experts, its range is understated and its actual range is 8,000 kms. Agni-5 is a highly precise weapon, it is navigated by ring laser gyroscope and inertial navigation system augmented with IRNS which gives it an error of less than 10 SEP, circular error probability. Further. Agni-5 is also available in the canister launch version which requires less time to ready the missile for launch when required which makes it an even more lethal weapon. Number 3. Future Development In future, Agni-V is expected to feature multiple independently targetable re-entry vehicle, MIRVs, with each missile being capable of carrying two 10 separate nuclear warheads. Each warhead can be assigned to a different target separated by hundreds of kilometers, alternatively, two or more warheads can be assigned to one target. MIRVs ensure a credible second strike capability even with few missiles. According to DRDO sources and MIRV payload would be significantly heavier, since it would consist of several nuclear warheads, each of them weighing about 400 kilograms. A five warhead MIRV, therefore, would weigh two tons. Number 2. International Reactions The United States stated that India boasted of an excellent non-proliferation record and that it had engaged with the international community on such issues. Chinese state-run media said that India still lags behind in infrastructure construction, but its society is highly supportive of developing nuclear power and the West chooses to overlook India's disregard of nuclear and missile control treaties and warned India not to overestimate its strength. Subsequently, they also claimed that although India may have missiles that can reach all parts of China, India stands no chance in an overall arms race with the country. Number 1. After Effects Indian authorities believed that the solid-fueled Agni-V is more than adequate to meet current threat perceptions and security concerns. Even with a range of only 5,000 km, the Agni-V could hit any target in China, including Beijing. The missile will allow India to strike targets across Asia and into Europe. The missile's range will allow the Indian military to target all of China from Agni-5 bases in central and southern India, further away from China. This will turn the balance of power in favor of India which is much required by New Delhi but a nightmare for Islamabad and Beijing.